spindle rod is connected to engine shaft either directly or through a gear mechanism. Flyweights along with ball arms rotate with the governor spindle. The speed of rotation of the ball arms and the degree of their outward motion is proportional to the engine speed. The spindle is connected to a linkage. A pivot supports the linkage. The other end of the linkage is connected to the fuel control valve through a fuel rod. At equilibrium condition or set speed, the speed of spring force matches the centrifugal force generated by the flyweights. When load on engine increases, engine speed starts to decrease. The rotational speed of the ball arms also decreases. Reduced speed of flyweights results in reduced centrifugal force. The speed of spring force exceeds the centrifugal force, causing flyweights to rotate close to the axis of rotation. This results in spindle or rotating sleeve to move down. The linkage at the other end moves up allowing more amount of fuel to engine. Due to increase in fuel supply, engine speed increases and reaches the set value. When the load on the engine decreases, engine speed starts to increase. The rotational speed of the ball arms also increases. Increased speed of flyweights results in increased centrifugal force. The centrifugal force exceeds the speed of spring force, causing flyweights rotate away from the axis of rotation. This causes the spindle or rotating sleeve to move up. The linkage at the other end moves down to reduce the amount of fuel to the engine. Due to decrease in fuel supply, engine speed reduces and reaches the set value.